Hello, it's your Aunt Vancy. As you can see, I am just out of the shower. You see, I use water the way that I appreciate it to cleanse my body and to replenish my body. I personally don't see the need to waste water and ice and dump it over my head to prove to you that I'm a good person and that I give of myself and my community. I don't need to explain that to you. I know what I do and I know what I give. And you see the difference between me and some of you who are having opinions about what I don't do is I'm not a braggart. My good deeds and my ways of giving are kept between me, the organization, and God, as it is intended to be. So for you to try to discredit me and call me out and tell me to write a check, that is lunacy. That is your insecurity within yourself trying to put your ill will on your own behalf onto my position. So you can keep that to yourself, honey. So this little trend that's going around, most of you hadn't even thought about ALS before all of a sudden it was the thing to do, to dare someone to dump ice on their head. Do you even know what it means, what it stands for, what the organization does? Or are you just the type of person that will lead as they are followed and do and follow suit to whatever everyone else is doing because your friends are calling you out to do it? My suggestion to you, my darlings, is to get your own backbone, not to use this as an excuse to show everyone that you were on trend by giving and giving a little money and writing a little check because that's what your friends are doing and because it makes you seem like you are all that and that you are doing what it takes to be proper and to be considered someone who gives of themselves. That is falsehood. And I suggest that you who are doing it for that particular reason, look into your hearts and see why it is you're doing what you're doing and what your motives are. Because I guarantee that when you do, you'll see that they are not true and they are not from your heart. Boo. Secondly, stop wasting water. This was originally meant for celebrities who have tons of money to give to research. If you want to do something for someone other than yourself, give to your own communities, to your own communities. There are smaller organizations that need funding. The kids in your community, the drug addicts in your community, the homeless shelters in community, the food pantries in your community, the cancer centers in your community, the AIDS research in your community. Shall I go on? Stop being idiots. Think with your head and not with your popularity button. Thirdly, I would also like to say to you, for all of you youngsters who are living two or three, four deep in a one, two bedroom apartment, who can barely pay your rent, who can't get find a job, who don't have a car, who are begging to eat, keep your money and pay your bills. How about that? How about that for doing something for yourself first? Take care of yourself, and then you can give to your community. Stop being foolish with your money and wasting water and your time and your energy. As my mother used to say to me, if somebody A jumped off the roof, are you going to jump off a roof too because it's the end thing to do? No, because you're not stupid. Now stop what you're doing and think. Think. God, y'all are frustrating me to no end. And stop trying to be what you're not. I say this with love and frustration because I know that you know better than that. Please, I implore you, give to your own communities and stop doing things to seem like you're something that you're not when you 
had no intention of doing that before it became a trend in the first place. Use water respectively. It's already being over-privatized, and before long, it's going to be a shortage of water. And here you all are wasting it. For what? For popularity's sake. Very disappointed, but hopeful, because I believe in you, and I believe that you will do the right thing. God loves you. Now love yourself enough. All right, I'm done. I'm off my soapbox. Take care.